When someone is referred for neuropsychological evaluation, they are often not sure what to expect. I'm going to explain what the purpose of the evaluation is, what to expect during the appointment, and how it might help you if your doctor recommends it. A neuropsychologist is a psychologist who focuses on the relationship between how the brain works, how it affects our thinking abilities, behaviors, and emotions. A neuropsychological evaluation can be helpful for many situations, including when someone has had an injury to their brain, such as a stroke or traumatic brain injury, when someone has a history of neurologic conditions, such as multiple sclerosis, or if someone is experiencing a change in their thinking abilities. When you are referred to a neuropsychologist, the first appointment will usually include an interview and testing. The interview will include questions about any changes you have noticed in your thinking, such as memory problems or difficulty focusing. You will also be asked about medical history, mental health history, work history, and school history. The testing will include several pencil and paper tests and will sometimes include tests on the computer. These tests will look at your overall abilities across several areas of thinking, including memory, attention, speed of thinking, language skills, and problem solving. The testing can take up to a few hours, so try to get good rest the night before your appointment. The purpose of a neuropsychological evaluation is to help measure your strengths and weaknesses. The main goal is to provide recommendations for things that might help improve your thinking abilities or reduce your risk for further change. After you complete the evaluation, the results will be sent to your doctor. You will also likely meet with the neuropsychologist again to go over the results and recommendations and to give you a chance to ask any questions.